everyone. Welcome back to Marvel Live from New York Comic Con 2014. I'm, of course, Lorraine Singh, host writer of Marvel's Watcher. Marvel.com editor Ben Morse here with one of Marvel's finest. Yeah. I would say I fan. No, I would say fan <laughs> favorite is an understatement when it comes to describing you. Phil Noto, artist of Black Widow, yeah. beloved by all, a gentleman and very talented as well. Thank you. you have survived two days of Comic Con almost. Yes. How are things going? Good, good, good. I'm taking the easy way out this weekend. Oh. Just kind of walking around, doing some signings and panels and interviews and yes, relaxing we, a little. We appreciate you coming things. here. This is, this is, I feel like this is different um, than the last two years because usually you're doing great covers, you're doing great issues here. And this is the first time in a while you've had like a regular, steady Marvel. Yeah, this has been my like, longest run on yeah. a Marvel book. I'm on issue 12 right now of Black yeah. Widow. And you haven't so. missed an issue. Nope. Which is a testament to you. Yeah. But no, I think we all knew that when you were coming <laughs> on. <laughs> no, they gave me enough time to do everything. I mean, it's, it's, it's tight every month, but I get it done. Mm -hmm. and Everybody's happy, so. How has that kind of changed just like your last year? How's the last year been different being like, okay, I'm working on the same thing month to month. It's, it's a Marvel book, set in the Marvel Universe, working on that. Like, well, it's nice because, I mean, they've allowed me to just kind of experiment with art styles and mm -hmm. being able to just do what I, you know, what I usually do outside of comics, like fine art-wise mm -hmm. and illustration, and I just get to have fun every month. And as long as the book comes out, everybody's happy. Absolutely, everybody's very happy. And what kind of response have you been getting? I mean, great. Black Widow is a great book. No, it's great because um, it was kind of, you know, this is her first, like, real mm -hmm. big ongoing solo book. So there wasn't a lot of press. Like, I wasn't following up some great run that, you know, somebody had done, mm -hmm. like, it, on a monthly book. So it's been easy. I've been able to, like, kind of, like, make my own mark on it. You're getting to do a very definitive yeah. run. Um, you're getting to really like define her in terms of her visual sense. And also, yeah. even though she's out there in the movies and you mm. know in the pop culture, I think, yeah, yours, yeah, is, yours is the one people yeah, think of Yeah, right she's uh, kind of an underused character right now in the comics, so Great. it's good. There wasn't a, a ton of pressure. It wasn't yeah. like some you know crazy Jean Grey solo book or something. So. Yeah. Have you seen any cosplayers wearing the uh, Black Widow white costume uh, with X twenty three in their casual wear and their like oh, casino no, wear. No, but I, I have I've heard seen, a lot of cosplayers saying that they were going to yes, do it. So yes, yes, I, I did. Um, I did see a few uh, earlier today though with like the silver and gray mm -hmm. stingers and whatnot cool. from the book, and so that's cool. That's, that's definitely cool. cool. I love that. I mean, can't change her up too much because she mm -hmm. still has to look like Black Widow. But that's it's true. been nice yeah. to see. You know my updated version. On are you gonna draw? Players. Are you gonna draw yeah. the '80s, '90s gray version in a flashback at some point with the short yes, hair? Yes, yes, I'd love to. <laughs> yes. I would love to see yes. your take no, on I've that. been, I've been dying to do kind of like a flashback story of Black Widow yeah. and yeah, she the, doesn't have the short hair yeah. with the. The, the little funny gray. bob. Yeah, the bob. She hasn't had too many yeah. costumes, but I feel like each one's been like fairly iconic. Like, My yeah, favorite yeah. is that the purpley one with, yeah, the, with the fishnet. Yeah, that's the other the one I was thinking of. Yeah, the mask. Oh, yeah. So ridiculous, you need, but wonderful. You need to find a reason to draw all of them in one I'll have issue. to figure that out. A team yeah. of Black yeah. Widows. Yeah. And of course... Talk, talk to Ellie and Nathan. <laughs> we have questions coming in from Twitter. Okay. If you Sophia, guys want to ask questions, use the hashtag MarvelNYCC. Sophia, sure. our friend from Spain, has been asking a lot of things, oh and she has a question for you. What's your favorite part about drawing Black Widow's uh, comics? Um, she's a fun character. Um, it's a lot of spy stuff, which I like to draw, mm -hmm. and um, you know, kind of make it look like my own James Bond movie with Black Widow every issue. That's a cool way to describe it. So that, but that's the way Nathan's been writing it, which has been really cool. So. How, how, how's, how's the relationship like with Nathan? Because I know when he pitched the book, he talked about he's, he specifically wanted you. Like, yeah. Unless this, this, was, this was a book that was going to go forward only if you were doing the other. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, it was, um, yeah, it's been great working with him because I've been able to, like, we talk on the phone and, mm -hmm. you know, figure out, like, which characters, like, you know, kind of guest stars and stuff we want to use and you know, talk about what I would like to draw in terms of environments and locations and whatnot. So it's been cool. I think that your your style has like such a painterly quality to it. Is mm -hmm. is it interesting working with colorists when you have such a... I do it all. You do it all, I always? I do all the colors and everything, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, I do, um, so that's your answer. It's there you terrible go. Yes. working with yeah. colors. Forget <laughs> them. Get rid of them. Yeah, they're horrible. Don't trust the waiting them. on the colors. Yeah. Yeah. Um, they're so no, beautiful. It's, uh, yeah, I do. This is the one... One of the greatest things about the books, like I've been able to just do everything. So mm -hmm. I start, it's all digital, but um, yeah, I start from the line art, then I finish up the final colors and send it in. That's so. amazing. You've gotten to draw a few guest stars so far, but yes, is there yes. anyone else you'd like to see drop um, by? 
Don't yeah, there are, me. but I can't. Yeah, I was going to say, don't spoil it. The minute starts, I ask the yeah, question. Yeah, starts getting into yeah, gray areas there. But um, no. yes, no, X-23 was awesome. That was I, very I cool loved, to see. I really miss drawing her, and so that was a lot of fun to do. And I liked it because in the in the X-23 book, they, of course, they had that brief interaction. Yeah. It was kind of cool to yeah. circle back oh, to that. Yeah, that. People, people cool. didn't realize that. Uh -huh. but, you know, nothing but... Yeah, they have a little bit of a history. So. It was neat. It was neat. Now, our own Art for Strangers would like to know, of course, he says he's a huge fan. Yeah. What is your creative process slash what do you use material-wise? Um, I use Photoshop on a Cintiq tablet on a 27-inch iMac. Mm -hmm. That's... That's ma the materials that I use. Um, in terms of process, I do like a, a light line drawing and then kind of go over that with color and then do more drawing on top of that. Cool. Very cool. Have you changed anything up as you've been going with Black Widow? Because like I said, you're getting to work on the same character month in, month oh, out. Oh, yeah, you, yeah. You I mean, of, I've yeah. been switching up styles yeah. here and there, you know, between the issues, depending on what, you know the environment that they take place in or the storyline and mm -hmm. just just trying to keep it interesting which sure and just nice. but just yeah. like being able to get used to it oh yeah 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 i mean i'm i i can draw her with my eyes closed now which really is nice, all right so and it's pen. only it's only one character which is nice because you know i've been talking to other guys that do team books and, yeah mm -hmm. yeah drawing like 17 people talking to each other so it's nice to just draw the one main character usually it sounds like a nightmare <laughs> speaking of which coming up next we'll have steve mcniven for true civil oh, war yes, which had yes, about eight thousand characters it. in it but um, <laughs> i don't know how he does it speaking of there? yeah oh speaking of lots of other characters is there a character that you haven't gotten to draw yet that you really are looking forward to drawing in the future or would <laughs> like to I don't know. I've I've been super lucky with Marvel being able to draw most of the characters that I've you know, that I like in terms of Marvel books. Um Domino I would love to draw oh, man. like that would fit in well, an yeah. actual book. I've done like, you know, little pictures that were mm -hmm. on my blog, but mm -hmm. nothing official, so well, Phil, where can people find you online? Like you said, um, you have a blog. I know you're on Twitter. It's, uh, yeah, on Twitter, Phil Noto. Um, the blog is just philnoto.tumblr.com. And, um, yeah, I mean, I, I post a lot of stuff on the blog, and I'm on Twitter now and then. Um, Facebook I'm also on, but I'm not really, I don't really do Facebook too much. So. Okay. And here's a little teaser for you guys. Sometime this weekend, we will have news yes. involving Phil. So stay tuned to marvel.com slash NYCC2014 for all of our live blogs, for all of our coverage. We're going to have Steve McNiven coming up next. You can send questions using the hashtag MarvelNYCC. But we will be your one-stop shop. One -stop shop. That's it. One-stop shop <laughs> for Phil Noto news coming this weekend. Sir, thank you for coming on the oh, show. You're this welcome. Is great. Thank it's you. great having you on. Thanks. You're doing great work on Black Widow. Thank we you. love it. And, of course, we're brought to you by Marvel Contest of Champions. Stick around and hashtag MarvelNYCC to us very soon. Hashtag.